Hello. Today I'd like to review with you a procedure you're about to undergo called Gold Fiducial Marker and Space or Hydrogel Placement. This procedure is relatively quick and will take approximately 15 minutes to complete. You will undergo general anesthesia, so I'd remind you you will need a driver to bring you home. You'll be given the exact appointment time, typically one to two days prior to your procedure. There are some preparatory steps you'll have to undergo. Approximately 24 hours prior to the procedure, you'll have to start a clear liquid diet. You'll also have to do a fleet's enema the night before and the morning of your procedure. You'll also be given an antibiotic prescription, and you'll need to take one pill twice a day, the day before, the day of, and the day after your procedure. On the given day of your procedure, you'll have an IV placed, and then the procedure itself will involve four needle sticks using 18 gauge needles. Those needles are not large, they're about the same size we use to place IVs and draw blood. You will be taken to the operating room and placed on your back and put to sleep. Once you're asleep, the legs will go up in the stirrups and an ultrasound probe will be placed in the rectum. The first three needles will go through the skin and into the prostate itself, and those will contain the three gold fiducial markers. The fourth needle will go in the space between the prostate and the rectum and through that needle, the hydrogel will be placed. Once the procedure is completed, you'll go to the recovery room. It'll take approximately 15, 20 minutes to wake up. And then within the hour, you can go home. Now, how will you feel after that procedure? You may be a little sore in that area and may have a slight bruise. Rarely could you see blood in the urine, but that is unlikely. I'd recommend you take it easy that day and back to normal activities the day after. Typically, approximately one week after your procedure, you'll come back to the Radiation Oncology Clinic and undergo a radiation treatment planning CT scan. Most of the time, you'll also undergo an MRI scan at the same time. Approximately seven to 10 days after the scans are completed, you'll then start your radiation treatments. If you have any further questions, feel free to reach out to your nurse or your radiation oncologist who can answer any further questions you might have. Thanks for your attention and have a good day.